Hello all of my gorgeous angels and devils, today I am playing another Minecraft horror map called The Asylum. So I already have all of the settings and everything prepared and let's do the mental health notice. While our map is called and themed off of an asylum, we would like to take this opportunity to point out that the fictitious asylum presented here is no in no way represents real life. Mental health. We tried to make this map scary by scripting in insane characters. However, mental health issues are an illness, not any form of insanity. There are many mental health organizations online where you can find out more information and help raise awareness of these issues. So they are not trying to make fun of anything like that. And I guess we can just begin. This is a crafting table. I'm guessing that's what... No, I don't know what that is. Okay, well, let's just... Oh, that was already... That's already kind of scary. Wasn't expecting someone to run out. And he's not... It doesn't even show him in that room anymore. He's not even in that room. All right, so we're... Oh, that wasn't even the beginning. Oh my gosh, I thought... Okay. Oh, okay, we gotta watch it. I wanted to move my head, and I guess we're not allowed. There goes the car. Oh no, we crashed! And a tree fell on us. The asylum. This is. I am impressed, and it's only been like a minute. <laughs> this is really cool. Kind of dark, though. Okay. Um. Uh, what happened? I sound like a dude. Don't. My phone's out. I need to find some help somehow. I wish it sounded like a girl for like char girl characters. Oh, hi bats! I'm not afraid of you because you can't hurt me. Haha. <laughs> Alright, I guess we just have to go this way. This is really cool looking. The Chartum Char Asylum. Asylum. And the ground. There should be top. someone there that can help. There's a map over here. Can I take it? I'd like to have this map for myself, even though it doesn't say that I'm on it. So, it's really cool how it's rolled up. It's so cute, and the music. Oh my gosh, I just love it. <laughs> I hope it's not too scary. <laughs> even though that, like, before the game even started, it freaked me out. I like how we have this little music. There is a man up there. Do you see him right there? Right there, is that a man? Yes, it is. That is a man. Are we on the map yet? No. Huh? Who's that? Hi. I oh, this is the groundskeeper, John. My phone's not working. Can you please help me? Sure. Glad to see other people. Oh, yeah. I thought that was him talking. Well, come on inside. I'll see what I can do for you. Does he actually get up and walk? Okay. The next day, I guess we just fell asleep. Glad to see Thanks. you're finally up. Thanks How long for the. Out for? Oh, just a couple of days. Do you couple of days? It said the keys? next day. I don't own one. But the asylum down the road probably has one. He's he's the whole point. I'm guessing we can't get anything. You know, he's the reason because of this. He's the entire reason that we're going to this asylum. That I don't want to go to. I don't even want to go to it. I didn't plan for this. I didn't want to. How do I get to the asylum? Um, it says it's down the road, but I'm so lost. This wasn't here before. Was this? This wasn't here. Was this here before and I just decided to walk past it? I don't think so. I think I would have went to this extravagant building. Look at this asylum. Like, look at it. Look how crazy this would take me forever to build. It's so gorgeous. I love it. Oh, that's the light. I thought I was stepping on a pressure plate. Like, I didn't know. It's going to close on us, isn't it? Of course. Of course it has to close and lock on us because we're not allowed out. I can't see anything. There's a, there's I a need key. to find a light. Okay, we got... Um, There's like a light right here, but... It's not letting us click on it. There we go. Gosh, that doesn't even help. Maybe it does help. 
I don't know. It's so gorgeous. Look at like look at those cobwebs. They're even amazing looking. Oh. Takes me a while, but why is there what is this? That's the generator room, a restricted area. Let's just head on upstairs. This sounds very creepy, so that's the cafeteria. All of these places seem to be locked, except for these ones. This is a toilet. I like bathrooms. I will sit in here. You can see through this bathroom. It's not a very not a very good bathroom, if you ask me. There's some blood. There's some blood on the wall. Just a bit. That's a lot. Emergency door unlocking. Eh. What door did I just unlock? I don't know. I'm just clicking button. He's naked. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> What the heck was that for? Were you supposed to do that? That's not very nice. I don't think that was very nice of you. Oh, it opened up this room. <gasps> a book fell out. The, it's a book. Just a book. What am I supposed to do with it? I'm gonna take it with me. Let's just use this flashlight. I don't like the flashlight. I think it makes it scarier. A bit scarier. Oh, there's stairs. I thought there's gonna be like a jump scare in the corner. Because, you know, that would be just absolutely lovely to have a jump scare. <laughs> These sounds are very cool because it sounds just like real life. Another key for the medical sector. Ooh, and another key. And that's for the archives. Awesome, awesome. So we have two keys now got nothing in there let's head out here what's outside whoa why did you close the window on me that's not very nice i was just admiring the beautiful view no one's in here right there's a potato <laughs> nothing in here nothing at all a book someone's diary the chef would cut off my toes okay good to know let's read dear diary i can't do it anymore i only have one finger left but the chef tells me if i don't give him my fingers john will come i don't want john to come john is a bad man john as in the john that we slept at his house do we have all of our fingers the groundskeeper the groundskeeper john is that you know, he's the one who sent me here. It pro it possibly could be him. I'm not ruling that out at all, because, you know. Seems like it. Wait, I forgot to go and look downstairs in that book room. Let's go check that out before I completely leave that area. Another Thinking clearly. Okay. Let's just check everything else before we read it. And there's, there's another chest. Oh, great. Hi! How are you? <laughs> okay. Yeah, like, you're not allowed. You're not allowed. Okay. <laughs> Let's read this. This library is my only escape. It's the only place I can think clearly. Yes, I need to break my legs. They are far too long. Yes, I need to spill my blood. It's far too dirty. Yes, I need to kill my daughter. She's been a naughty girl. Well then, that's that's something. Let's go check out these other rooms now. I don't understand what these railroad track type things are doing. I don't understand that. Why is there? It looks like a block is missing. We didn't go this way. Huh. I wonder what's behind that door. All right, should we go into the medical or the archives? Oh, it closed. I was like, what? What? Okay, let's go into the medical. This will be our second stop. We have Dr. Diddly Doo, Warden's office. Let's head into here. Hello, Dr. Diddly Doo. Oh, and there's a medical storage which has some blood in it. Awesome. Gotta love some blood. I don't see anything fancy in here though. No keys. It's just a room. So I guess we can head on down this ladder. 
see what Dr. Diddly Doo has to offer. Oh, great. Now we can't get him. Follow the blood and you shall find the thing that made the manager blind. The manager didn't want to play our game. Great. Great. Are you ready to play our game? I have no choice. Have no choice. It says to follow the blood and you'll find where he went. That's, that's kind of scary. That's a bit scary. Are you supposed to like find it before? I'm confused. I'm not allowed up there. I don't know. I don't understand this. What's over here? No, I got this key. I got this key that I will fight you with. I am so confused. I'm very confused. What just happened? Is there a secret door or something in here? Let's, what opened? A door definitely opened. Just not right here. It had to open something in here or I feel like the door would have shut if we didn't figure everything out. Hmm, hmm. Door opened, but where? Where could that door have gone? No. Why am I typing www? www. Whoops, I took the blood off the wall. I'm sorry, I don't want it anymore. I didn't mean to. I'm so lost. So confused. So confuzzled on what it meant. I know it said follow the blood. Okay, let's just leave this area and head into the archives. And from there, we can, you know, check out. Oh, it did say follow the blood. Maybe that's why. Because now, like, we're supposed to follow this blood. And here is a patient. Alright, medical condition. The patient seems to communicate with imaginary friends. Subject has a hard time understanding reality and refuses to interact with other humans. Alright. What this looks like. Should I follow the blood? Is something supposed to happen when you step on that? I don't know. I'm lost. Oh, the patient sector is now open. Well, now we're locked into this one. All right, room 506. Let me in. They feel, they run, they feel, they try, they succeed, they sleep. They hear, they might wake, they are here, they are many, they don't see, they need, they walk. Well, okay. Anything else? Oh, they hide. Yep, it hid. What's up there? <gasps> Hyper fun. That's my favorite band. Creepy. Room number two. No, I don't want to sleep. I'm sorry, but I really don't want to. Okay, let's go into this room. There's some blood. And we have my teeth. Is this a bathroom? You can, you know, make some music as you're in the bathroom. My teeth. I wish I had my legs back again. I shouldn't have eaten them. I should have eaten my arms instead. It's hard to drag myself around the room, but I needed my arms for ripping apart flesh. My teeth can't... They... My teeth can't the work. Can't do the work. Now where are we off to? Room number three. It's a little dark in here. A little creepy, but don't think we have to go in there. And room number four. We have ears. The screams are too much at night. I told the doctor I couldn't stand it anymore. He helped me. I can't hear the screams anymore. It's just a shame I have I no longer have ears. Well, I don't think that would be very just get rid of my ears. I don't like the screaming. <laughs> Just get rid of it all. What's in here? I wonder this... if this old jukebox will play the record. Hey, an enchantment book. Enchantment. <gasps> oh my gosh, do you see him crawling? There he's going. Is he there? Oh, you're not allowed. You're not allowed to see him as he just slithers away. Well then, 
That's lovely. Did he go into this room? He had to have gone over here. This is just odd. Hmm. I thought I heard someone walking. No one? No one over here? What is this? Subject chamber one. Pain is good. They must feel the pain. Okay. Good for them. Let's go back up and leave this. <laughs> let's go try somewhere else out. So we walked down there, so let's go down these steps now. Wait, this is where we came from. So we have to go up the stairs. A creeper is wanted, it looks like. Um, don't know. Don't know what door was open. I don't know. I'm kind of worried. So we have to go down that long hallway that I already don't want to go down. Okay. Oh. Monsters like this don't scare me. <laughs> when I see them coming, it's no problem. I can handle it. What's over here? Hello? Oh, I took his head! They're crying! I need okay. To get out of here. Hello? They're not gonna talk to me. They're just like little creepy children. What room is this for? The restricted area. Great! We're gonna go to the restricted area. There is a reason why it is restricted. Let me tell you. <laughs> Let's find out why it is restricted so much. Can only imagine. Okay, all of these doors are now open. This area is restricted. There we go. Wasn't working at first. Okay, let's head on down. What do we have to find? Power generator room. And lots more blood. Bloody blood. This, you know, this is a little creepy. They have jail cells. Is there people in there? No, but you know, they're down here. <gasps> I knew it! I told you when they said John, it was him! It was him! Hey, what Watch are you it. doing down here? I don't know. I got down here, the door locked behind me, and I was knocked unconscious. Oh dear. Where is he? You'd better try to get yourself out. This room looks awfully dangerous, but the door is still locked. How am I meant to get out, and how did you get in? Oh, I came in here with you. No, you didn't. I never saw you. You liar. Oh, you never saw me. But I've been with you for a very long time now. Just hidden away. What do you mean? Who are you? My car crashed here 20 years ago, and I met the old manager of this asylum. He offered me a job, so I became a caretaker here. Oh, so you have a key to the door then? When I first started working here, it was dreadful. Listening to the Can insane cries from the patients. But the more I started to listen, the more I began to realize they were right. What are you talking about? They told me how it was fun to kill people. Stab them or suffocate them. So I tried it out. And you know oh what? Oh my gosh, he's a crazy it man. Was. I started with the manager. He never respected me anyway. And then the staff, and finally every patient here. They were the most fun. They understood my desires. Get away from me! I'm sorry. I can't do that. He's gonna kill us I can't next. believe you haven't realized yet. I'm you. <laughs> What? I wasn't... I wasn't prepared for that. Wow. Wow. Okay. Wow. That's crazy. I didn't think it was me. That was really good. Gosh, the acting, the story, the texture pack, the... Just everything was awesome. Oh my god. So we have textures, music, voice acting by these people right here. We have the Redstoners and the, I guess, Sun Fury. I'm guessing these are the people who helped with everything else. 
I don't know. <laughs> so that was the asylum. Really crazy, really awesome. It wasn't too scary, but it did really have that creepy feel, and the story just made it way better. So if you guys enjoyed and would like to see more, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you aren't already. I'll talk to you all later. Bye!